Hello everyone, welcome to this YouTube channel. Myself Roslyn and in this video we will see how to add hierarchy slicer with multiple selections in Power BI. And these are the two headings that we are going to cover in this video. First we will see how to add hierarchy slicer with multiple selections. Secondly we will see how the Power BI applies the slicer to multiple tables. So let's begin with the Power BI hierarchy slicer multiple selections. Here you can see this is how the hierarchy slicer looks like and with multiple selections. And it filters and displays the data accordingly in the table visual. Now I will show you how to add the hierarchy slicer with multiple selections in Power BI. For that, log into the Power BI desktop here and load the data using get data option. Click on the get data option, select Excel workbook, click connect and choose the Excel workbook and click on the table that you want to load into the Power BI desktop. Here I am going to choose all the three data table and I am going to click on this load option. Once the data has been loaded, and under fields pan we can see the data has been added and in the data view we can view the data. Now go back to the report view to add the hierarchy slicer with multiple selections. Here we are going to add the slicer with product category, customer segment and with the region. So under visualization select the slicer visual and also the table visual. In the slicer visual drag and drop the fields of product category, customer segment and region. Now increase the font size of the slicer slicer visual for that select the slicer visual expand the values and increase the font size in the same way for slicer header also increase the font size here you can see the hierarchy slicer has been added in the table visual drag and drop the fields from the field pan now align the slicer visual and also align the table visual accordingly here also i am going to increase the font size for the table visual in addition i am going to add the sales field here so that we can view the sales value as well whenever we add the multiple fields for the slicer visual by default it is taking as a hierarchy slicer to select multiple values in the hierarchy slicer click on this control option and choose the value for which you want to display and view the data in the table visual so here you can see in the first field product category is there so that it displays the furniture office supplies and technology in second customer segment is there so when you expand this furniture you can see the customer segments like consumer corporate home office and small businesses when you expand this office supplies then in the same way you can see the customer segment for this product category similarly for the technology product category also you can view the customer segments now for each customer segment it displays the region here you can see for this consumer customer segment it displays the region similarly for corporate similarly for home office and for the small business in the same way for other product also it displays the same this is how the hierarchy slicer looks like now if i want to apply filter for this furniture it by default it takes all these values that are presented in the data table so i want to view only for the particular data in that case click on the screen clear selection and if i want to view only for the furniture that happened on the consumer customer segment only for the east region then click on this so that here you can see automatically it applies the filter for the first level which is product category and the second level which is customer segment and the region that we have selected is east so in the product category you can see it filters and displays data only for the furniture product category and the segment is consumer segment not the corporate not the home office and also the small businesses and the region also you can see it displays the only for the east region if i want to view for the west region also then in that case click on the control key presented in the keyboard and select the west option here you can see the table visual has been changed which displays the furniture product category consumer customer segment and for in the region you can see it filters and displays the data for each east and west option and it displays the sales value accordingly this is how to add the hierarchy slicer and choose the multiple selection in the hierarchy slicer if i want to view for the technology product category for the consumer segment the same east and west category then in that case click on this control key presented in the keyboard and choose the east and the west here you can see it displays the product category which is furniture and also the technology and 
the customer segment selected for this also consumer and here also the consumer so in the technology also you can see the consumer similarly the region is east and west and also it displays the sales value based on the filter applied in the hierarchy slicer with multiple selection to clear the hierarchy slicer select the slicer visual click on this tier selection option and it removes all the filter that that are applied in the hierarchy slicer this is how we can work with the hierarchy slicer with multiple selection in power bi report next we will see how to apply the slicer to multiple table which means we have two table visual here and based on the selected values the filter should apply for both the table visual now i will show you how to do that here i am going to add one new page and i am going to add the slicer visual which consists of the product category and i am going to increase the header value size and the value size now i am going to add two table visual this is my first table visual and this is my second table visual select the table visual and drag and drop the product category customer segment and the sales value now i am going to increase this table visual font size similarly i am going to add data field from the field pan in the table visual 2 now select the table visual 2 here i am going to add only the customer segment and its profit value here also i am going to increase the font size and the column header and this is my table table visual 1 and this is my table visual 2 and this is my slicer visual now based on my slicer selection it should filter filter and display the value in both the visual here you can see I have selected for the product category field. In table 1 visual, the product category field is presented. In table 2, it is not presented. Still, whenever we apply the filter in the slicer visual, we can see it applies for the both table visual and displays the data accordingly. This is how we can apply filter for multiple table visual in the Power BI report. Here also, we can apply multiple selection in the slicer visual by clicking on the control key presented in the keyboard. Here if I want to display the data for office supplies and technology then here you can see in the product category it displays the data for office supplies and technology and here also it displays the data only for the selected product category. This is how to use the slicer visual to apply filters on the multiple tables that are presented in the Power BI report. With this we came to the end of this video where we have learned how to apply hierarchy slicer with multiple selection in the Power BI report and how to use Use the slicer visual to filter multiple tables that are presented in the Power BI report. Thanks for watching this video and these are the free video tutorials that are presented in our YouTube channel. Please check it out and please do subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos. Thank you.